us some good news? Wouldn't you like to hear about referral rates dropping? Time to Teach can do that for you. It can cut the referral rate sometimes by as much as 80 to 90%. But one thing that we have to realize is something that somebody very wise said a very long time ago. Kids don't care how much we know until they know how much we care, right? Another thing that is central to the time to teach method is that every child has the capacity to learn. I, this is just true. Every child has a capacity to learn. Most people learn how to walk before they learn to speak the English language. All right, there's not, a, there's not a method or there's not a manual or anything like that that says use your muscles to do this and everything like that. So obviously, there are several ways that we learn. In other words, the behaviors that you have seen these kids do up until this point, they can change. They can learn new behavior. It's a matter of conditioning. Or for your principals out there, or for your system administrators that are out here listening to this, think about this. They did an experiment. This is, uh, again, out west. They did an experiment with, with time to teach. And they decided there were two elementary schools and they were basically following and been for a few years following the same curriculum path at the same pace. The test scores were fairly similar. Is for the first 30 days, the first 30 days of school, with elementary school A, they put the time to teach, teach two methods into effect. They left school B by itself, okay? They're going along on their curriculum and everything like that. Time to teach school over here, school number A, is doing nothing but behavioral teach twos for 30 days. They would do a teach two on assemblies, teach two on how to go to the bathroom, how to ask to go to the bathroom, when it is appropriate to go to ask to go to the bathroom, how to get up and get materials from the back of the class, how to bring them back, et cetera, et cetera, to everything. And they put a little bit of curriculum in there just for measure so that people wouldn't flip out too much. And people were starting to get nervous. We're losing 30 days of instruction here. Uh, you know, these guys are, are light years ahead of us. By the Thanksgiving break, school A was 30% farther ahead in the curriculum than school B was. 30% farther ahead. They had taken the first 30 days and done nothing but build their foundation. But they built their foundation so solid that when they decided to come in on the 31st day and say, okay, this is what we're learning how to do today. See, they had been teaching this whole time, folks. They just been teaching the behavioral parameters. Another thing that we have to resign ourselves to the fact these days is that many of our children are coming in to the schools almost completely unsocialized. We assume too much. We assume that they know how to act. They know how to come into assembly and sit quietly. They don't. And how are they going to learn unless you send a teacher? And how are they going to how are they going to learn it unless you make it a part of your lesson plan? I mean, principals are going to love it. You principals are going to love this because those referral rates are going to come flying down. You're also going to like it, the fact that the, your teachers are going to walk out of here happy. Administrators, you can look to the county to your left, county to your right, and go, because your test scores are going through the roof. Your dropout rates are plummeting. Your kids are excited about being at school. You do that as a system. Can you imagine how easy it will be by the time they hit third grade, much less 10th or 11th grade? Let's say we use 10% of our brain. 10% of our brain. That's by the end of our life we use 10% of our brain. There's enough room up there for them to learn. We stay, we, we stay away from the connotation of program because how many people, you system administrators out there, you might have done it for your county here or you might have done it for, uh, or might have known somebody that has done this in the past that pay hundreds of thousands of dollars, maybe millions of dollars for the latest and greatest curriculum plan. We've been doing this for 40 years. And that new program that you adopt this year is the answer to, it's the solution to all your problems. 
three years from now, it'll be the cause of all your problems. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? 